Hey guys, Aubrey here. Today I'm doing the Eureka Math Grade 3 Module 3 Lesson 7 homework. So let's get started. Number one, match the words on the arrow to the correct equation on the target. All right, so let's see, what are we doing here? First, um, the arrow, we have seven times a number equals two. So, um, equals 42. So seven times a number, and our number would be like represented by, in this case, n. So seven times a number equals 42. Well, our equation will look like this one, seven times number, but we don't know what number it is, equals to 42. So these two arrows and the um, board and the target matches. All right, and now it says 63 divided by a number equals nine. So what on this page, um, on the targets equal nine? Over here it says 63 divided by a number that we don't know equals nine. So this matches with that. Now 36 divided by a number equals six. So this one matches because 36 divided by a number that we don't know equals to six. So this matches. And a number times seven equals 21. Um, we don't know this number, so it's n times 7 equals 21. So, yeah. All right, next page. Number two, Ari sells six boxes of pens at the school store. Um, a, each box of pens sells for, sells for $7. Draw a tape diagram and label the total amount of money he makes as m. Write an equation and solve for m. All right, so tape diagram. So six boxes and each box for $7. So seven, 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 seven. So the total amount is what we're trying to find out. And we represent the total amount of money as M. So let's write our equation. We have six times seven equals M. That's our total amount. So then M equals 42 because six times seven is 42. We can box our answer, which means Ari makes $42. All right, and now for B, each box contains six pens. Draw a tape diagram and label the total number of pens as P. Write an equation and solve for P. All right, so six boxes and six in each box. So one, two, three. And then we have six in each box. So what is the total number of pens? We're doing P for pens. Six times six equals P. That's the number of pens. So then P equals 36 which means there are 36 pen. All right, and number three, Mr. Lucas divides 28 students into seven equal groups for a project. Draw a tape diagram and label the number of students in each group as N. Write an equation and solve for N. All right, so our total is 28 students and there's seven eagle groups but we want to find out how many are in each group so what we do is we do 28 divide by 7 or this is n and that will give us n so then n equals 4 because 20 divided by 7 is 4. so there are four students in each group. Okay. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this video helps, and please don't forget to like and subscribe because it really helps on my channel. See you guys next time. Bye.